The 1990s basketball star had a clean record until last month. Now he's been arrested twice within a month for a 1999 statutory rape. After his arrest last month in Cranston, Abdul Abdullah told Target 12 he had verbal permission from his Georgia probation officer to move to Rhode Island. And he claims the officer said he could report to him with monthly phone calls. Court records indicate Abdullah pleaded guilty to statutory rape in 2005 after he was arrested in 2003 in a case involving a 14-year-old victim who was the daughter of Abdullah's stepsister. He was initially charged with six counts, and according to his court file, he was sentenced to 10 years with six months to serve. Despite his claim that he had permission to move from Georgia, he was arrested on a 2006 warrant for allegedly violating the terms of his probation. Then just last week, Providence police filed an arrest warrant that states Abdullah had a duty to register as a sex offender in Georgia and that duty would carry over to Rhode Island. Abdullah was arraigned on the sex offender registration charge on Tuesday and released on bail. His Rhode Island attorney tells Target 12 he is waiting for documents on the case from Georgia before comment. Commenting. Abdullah has not responded to requests for comment from Target 12. A status conference on the probation violation case is scheduled for next week. A pre arraignment conference on the sex offender registration charge is scheduled for October. With the Target 12 investigators, Walt Buteau, Eyewitness News.